Leanne's Leanne Morajon reports from the courthouse in Miami and she joins us live. Leanne. Yeah, the judge actually making that decision today. We do know that he did consider the details of the crime that Marin was convicted of committing. He says that this wasn't just any ordinary kidnapping for a ransom, but that it was with the specific intent to torture the victim. And for that, he sentenced him to life in prison. On count one, manslaughter with a weapon, I sentence you to 30 years in state prison. On count two, conspiracy to commit kidnapping or aggravated battery, I sentence you to 15 years in state prison. And on count three, kidnapping, I sentence you to life in prison. Manuel Marin, the co-founder of Presidente Supermarkets, sentenced to life in prison. The judge handing down the sentence for manslaughter, kidnapping, and conspiracy to commit kidnapping. Marin was convicted back in March for his role in the death of his wife's lover, Camilo Salazar. We've been able to bring justice to the Salazar family. And we're happy to know that tonight when they go home, they will know that justice has finally been served. The hearing began with a photo montage set to music. The judge later heard from the victim's loved ones. We didn't get a chance to say goodbye. We didn't get a minute. We didn't get a hug. Because of Manuel Marin's selfish and sadistic actions, my brother's no longer with us. During his trial, prosecutors said Marin was the mastermind behind a murder-for-hire plot targeting Salazar. He was tied up, severely beaten, and had his throat slit and burned alive. Evidence presented at trial showed Marin's phone pinged near the crime scene, and a witness testified Marin actively participated in Salazar's kidnapping. Family members on both sides declined to speak after the hearing. A man who said he was Marin's best friend, however, vouched for his character. Manuel Marin se enamoró de la persona incorrecta. Y por eso está pasando todo esto. At the end of the hearing, it was clear he intends to appeal this sentence. For now, reporting in Miami, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News.